132 left. Zurich Phelps nailed a jump shot, making it a one-point game, but that was not enough as SMU suffered their third consecutive loss, 77-73, to UTSA. Now, star guard Chuck Harris was ruled out tonight, which left a huge hole offensively. And to top it all off, SMU blew a 13-point lead going into halftime and simply could not pull away in the second half. With 132 left in the game, Zurich Phelps nailed a jump shot, making it a one-point game, but it wasn't enough as SMU suffered a 77-73 loss to UTSA, making it three consecutive losses for the Mustangs. Now, star guard Chuck Harris was ruled out tonight, which was a huge hole offensively for the Mustangs. And to top it all off, they blew a 13-point lead going into halftime and simply could not pull away in the second half. Zurich Phelps kept his team in the game, scoring 18 points alongside Jalen Smith, who registered 15. Head coach Rob Lanier said post-game that the major difference maker tonight was a sense of urgency and energy from his team. The difference between becoming good and taking the next step. And we were in that space. It's, I would equate it to, um, you know, an NFL player who does great during the regular season. and then, But it's something more required when you get to the playoffs. And the Mustangs will be back in action this Wednesday when they take on East Carolina in their final regular home game of the season. For all things SMU basketball, tune into Spectrum Cable Channel 15 every Wednesday and Thursday night at 11. In Moody Coliseum, reporting for G210 Sports, I'm Morgan Alexander, and you have just been credentialed.